Hi everybody, welcome to my channel and another video about cotton pine cone mouse and rabbit. In today's video, I'm going to share a kit craft idea with you so you can make it easily with your children at home or a student at a school. So if you are ready, just keep watching the video. What we need is a pine cone. I painted in blue, but you can choose any other color that you want. For your information, I painted with a normal flat brush and acrylic color. It could take a bit of time to paint every side of the cone because it has lots of different edges, but keep remembering your mind to use a tough brush, then it makes the painting process easier. The next material is raw cotton but you can also use raw wool, toilet paper or some other fluffy material like this. Also, we need yarn. I use blue because of her body. Colored paper. I normally paint the stickers by hand and use them instead of regular colored paper. Scissor and glue. The whole process is too easy. We need to stick the raw cotton inside the pine cone edges. Also, this step is too fun and I'm pretty sure the kids would love it. This step takes a bit of time, so I would show the whole process in fast speed motion. I think my pine cone is ready covered by cotton. So literally, we made a fluffy body for our rabbit. Next step is making an eye. We need to make small round shaped cotton just like when we work with clay. As you may see, these cotton round eyes are so fluffy and not exactly capable of being like eyes. So what we can do to fix them together? I'm using a white yarn and twist it around each eye till give a more roundy shape to it. I think this one is already ready. Then I will glue the extra yarn on its body. Then with the same technique we would make tail and nose and the other eyes either. we would attach all the things to the body. It's so easy, don't you think? If there is an empty place on the cone, then you can fill it with extra cotton. I would add some beads as it's pupil. For the ear, first you should bend the paper in half, then draw a shape of the ear on it, and with your scissor, cut around the lines, and glue them to the head, just easy like that. Yes, 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 the rabbit is ready, and here is his mate. Well, I hope you enjoyed this video, please give me a big thumbs up, comment below and share your ideas with me. Your likes and comments could help me so much. Love you always and see you next time.